Creed 2, where we are going to complete uh, Sequence 11. That's right, Sequence 11 as we climb up on the banister and just kind of have fun. So, Sequence 11, let's go do our thing. Uh, yeah, the chest is empty. We've got all we can get right now. So, yeah, let's just do what we do. So we're going to go back to Venice. And... Yeah, let me... Uh, yeah, Venice, 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 Venice. What am I doing? I'm just playing around. Being goofy. Okay, yeah. Because, you know, hey. It's an early day. I didn't sleep much. Didn't sleep well. But, hey, it is what it is, isn't it? Okay, so we know that... It's straight over there, so it's probably easier if we go to the bridge. Because I think it's just a straight shot from the bridge to where the uh, start point is. So that's what we'll do. How is everybody's weekend going so far? Obviously, if you're up early like I am, uh, then, hey, you got an early start. Or you just didn't sleep well or you went to bed really early either way whatever trips your trigger so to speak floats your boat blows your skirt up that would be a sight okay excuse me pardon me coming through coming through leave me alone mr weirdo nobody wants to be bothered by you uh, I am just going to grab this wanted poster down real quick. Just because, you know, it is what it is. Right? And we'll go this way. Oh, we went the wrong way. No, we didn't because, look, a treasure. Lucky us. Two treasures. And there just happens to be a stupid guard just standing there all by himself. And I don't get that because there's nobody to witness that. Nobody saw me do that, so why? Why exactly did I get notoriety? I don't know, but it was well worth it because it was a over a grand. These are usually a hundred. Yep. There you go. No fuss, no must type situation. Oh. Well, apparently I'm using the the crooked controller. This is the one I usually use for. Driving anyhow. So okay, here we're going. Uh, I don't. I think this is where we intercept the apple. Uh, and we kind of. There's a similar. There's a similar thing done in. Um, they redo this thing in Revelations. Okay, it looks like we had to go into the... We got to go into that area there. So, okay, we'll just go up and through. Up and around. Not where I wanted to go, but that's fine. I'll go this way. Uh, yeah, back to what I was saying. <coughs> um, they, uh, they did something similar in Revelation. No, Brotherhood. It would be Brotherhood. Brother no, it's Brotherhood. It's Brotherhood. Uh, I, I get all these games mixed up sometimes. But uh, that one gets a little bit more in depth, though, because you got to follow the right path. Uh, this one, I think you just follow the guy, if I'm not mistaken. I'm just going to... dress up as uh, that guy there holding the apple. <clears throat> now what's interesting is they make this apple look like the one from Musayaf. So maybe they're trying to get us to believe that's the same apple or maybe they weren't thinking uh, or maybe they just hadn't planned ahead. I'm trying to think. Would Revelations had already been in the works at this time? Um, yeah, they probably would have started it at least. 
What do I got to do? Tail. Okay, I got to tail the courier on this one. So... <clears throat> I thought he was going to stop and look. So, <clears throat> what was I saying? Oh, yeah. I'm trying to think where line of thought I was going down. Uh, yeah, oh, the apple. The apple of Eden. That's right. Because, spoiler alert if you haven't played Revelations yet. Um, you find that... Altair kept his apple and hid it away in the library at Musayef. So there's no way that this is that same apple. Because Ezio finds that apple later. That's basically at the end of uh, that's at the end of Revelations is where Ezio returns to Mosayef, opens the library, and sees that's where Altair's Apple of Eden is, and he leaves it for someone else to find, which I believe we come to find out probably was modern day Abstergo. That was one that they had found. So yeah. But I don't know if that's in, if it was ever found retrieved by anybody. It could, you know, as far as the game goes, it could still be sitting in Mosayef. You know, of course now the assassins know about it because of the memory. Oh crap! We gotta go up and over. He's looking, he's looking. Yep. Off you go. Let them have it. Okay, get rid of those guys quick. We got you guys gotta be quick about this. Alright, I'm gonna He went this way. There he is. Okay. So yeah, I mean, I don't, it's hard to say about... Look at this idiot. So which part of your... Uh, yeah, so who knows if... Um... The apple has ever been recovered. Musa, yeah, that is. Uh, this apple here is the one. This is going to be Ezio's apple. That will it will be the one that is. The story of brotherhood is centralized around. So this apple, that obviously Rodrigo will end up getting it. This is the one that Leonardo will ultimately begin to study. Okay, this one, if I remember right, because he... He goes out and then he comes in, because I think I've tried to do this. So you gotta watch it here. There you go. Because he went right by me. Tricky, tricky little section there. I'm not doing anything. Right, I'm just going to go do this. You guys get out of my way, I swear. I'm going to stab one of you. If not all, I'll drop a smoke bomb and take you all out. Simple as that. Alright, the courtesans have caught back up to me. This I'm just going to go... Roger, what? Come back here. 
Didn't realize I had that guy on my butt. There we go. All right. will not suffer mistakes. Fair enough. Do it now. The Spaniards here. Okay, so we got to take both these guys out. I can infiltrate this group. All right, that that was nice. So here we go. I have 90 seconds to get that, so we're gonna get these courtesans. And we're gonna have them distract them to that side, and I'm gonna come around. Are you kidding me? You're not allowed through. Go. The rats will have a rare treat this night. All right, freaking idiot. That was not. That did not go as planned. Hmm. They just must not have been that guard's cup of tea. There you go. You need to have some male cortisones in here as well. Yeah? Okay. So maybe we do this. This time we're distracting that specific guy. Alright, there we go. Oh, bugger all. Okay, well. When you break the rules, we break you. Okay. I'm going to try something else. I'm not going to use the girls. I'm going to go up and over. We'll see if that is a little bit more pleasing idea. All right, there's nobody on the rooftop. Well, no, there is. There is one guy. Oh, for crying out loud. Mother Teresa's. That's what I meant to say, yes. Mother Teresa's. That's what I was going to say the entire time. So, okay, here we're... We'll keep going at it. Must be a feather nearby or treasure. Would you just climb, please? I would really appreciate this. All right, there's this guy here. Just gonna kind of. There we go. All right. Take this guy out. Wonderful. Now there's another patroller. He should be coming into view here shortly. No, I thought there was. Okay. Oh, there he is. We're just going to run and gun. Do that. Different kind of armor than the guy we just took out, but hey, whatever. Okay, so finally we got that. And so we're going to pick up the box and we got to follow the guy. <clears throat> yes, sir. This is a moment of great importance. Stay great in formation. Make Stay in formation. this right. <clears throat> That's all you gotta do. Just try not to drop the box, run into people, have people run into you. There will be things that basically the don't draw attention to yourself. That is the key. So keep a somewhat of a distance. And also keep an eye out for everybody around you. See the box carriers? They're, they're going to come at you in force. So just when they get close like that, just stop and they'll avoid you. Okay. That's the best recommendation I can make for that this section. Uh, because if you drop the box and draw attention to yourself, then, you know, crap. Uh, you don't want to get into a scuffle with anybody because then, you know, the, the guard has to protect you and he's going to lose health and, yeah, you don't want any of that garbage because the guys behind you really don't do anything for you. 
So you just kind of got to quarter stick it. And even that, you're walking too fast. You walk up on him eventually because he's very inconsistent in my mind about his speed. You know, but you don't want the guys behind you to run up on you either. That's why it's it's it can get tricky. You know, hopefully you got a decent controller. If your controller is kind of lagging, and you know, fortunately you don't have far to go. Because here's Rodrigo. We have it. We're not followed. He's all happy because he's gonna get his apple. We have followed your orders. And here we go. Exactly as specified. The mission to Cyber. Whoops. <gasps> he did. He did. That's you. It's been some time. Nice. Lovely. Well done. Rodrigo. So, where is he? <laughs> Who? Your prophet. Yes. Doesn't look like anybody showed up, Rodrigo. How many people have died for these? For what's in these box? And look. This is There's the beauty. This is here. this is. I remember when I first played this game. You and claim not to be a believer. The uh, revelation of this. Don't you see? Him? Pun intended, by the, the way. Prophet is uh, <laughs> the revelation I of this. Um, now it's pretty cool. Once Momentum I realized it, me. that Ezio, in fact, Ezio is the. Uh, <laughs> Profit. Basically, the best way to fight Rodrigo is a defensive strategy. You know, if you just keep blocking and countering, you're going to wear him down. I mean, it's slow and tedious, but it gets the job done. And it keeps your health up because... Come on, old man. There we go. You don't want to get let him get on the offensive. There we go, and you get him down to that. Is this Cut all scene. You Where is get the some guards coming people? in, but you'll get What's some backup. People? You really have no idea, do you? Guards! Again, stay with the defense. Remember your training, man. Stay with your defense. You are dead, man. Walking to your plane. They're gonna all right, they're starting to double and triple team me, so I might as well, I gotta take some of them out. No more defensive strategy. Remember your training, man! That's the key to take out, because he'll keep tripping you. There we go, back to Rodrigo, cutscene. Now we get Uncle Mario. Don't worry, Nipote. You are not alone. Nipote, does that mean nephew in Italian? La Volpe's here? What are you doing here? Bartolomeo will show up. Antonio? Save your questions, brother. Don't let Borja leave that box. Okay. Back. I'm gonna focus mostly on Rodrigo. Yeah, I'm taking out. I'm taking out the main guys. What lies in the vault shall be mine. Come on, son. There we go. Just hammer on him. Take the big guys out. Let the 
Let your assassin friends deal with the... There you go, just slice and dice. Alright, Mario's handling his own. There you go. This war has been going on far longer than either of us have played a role. Alright. Now we just hammer home on Rodrigo. All of us smashing our heads together! Wonderful. Uh, going all out on him. Because the last time you know, fought together. There's so many of you, you can just hammer him. And then you'll hammer him until there's a cutscene. Okay. He's gone, but we Hola. have what we came for. No, I need to go after him. Do you Hola. really now? Or the are you here for another Paola. reason, my son? Theodora, what? Yeah. What are you all doing? There you here? go. They're all here. Perhaps the same thing you are, Ezio. Oh. Hoping to see the prophet appear. I came here to here kill the Spaniard. Go. I couldn't care less about your prophet. He never showed up. No. Really? But you did. There you go. What? A prophet's arrival was foretold, and unbeknownst to us, here you are. See now, Perhaps when he along, revealed himself to be Machiavelli, and then I was like, oh wow, Who this, this game just took a turn. Di Bernardo di Machiavelli. <laughs> Machiavelli, baby. I am baby. an assassin, trained in the ancient ways to safeguard mankind's evolution. Read his books, just like you, you'll get it. And each one of us here. You are all assassins? Paola. Volpe. It's true, Lipote. We have all been guiding you for years, teaching you the skills you would need to there join our go. ranks. I think it's time. We have our prize, but there is much to be done. Come, meet us here at sunset. Now you go to the viewpoint. Uh, down in the Castillo, Castillo I think. Alright. I think that's where we are. These are the words spoken by our ancestors that lay at the heart of our creed. Where other men blindly follow the truth, remember, nothing is true. So here we Where go. Other men are limited, We're going to have one more section to go, and that remember, is to go to Rome, is permitted. to the Vatican, we work in the dark to serve uh, the light. with our we goal to assassinate Rodrigo. Nothing Rodrigo. is true. Everything, Everything is permitted. Uh, we do have the apple. In this modern age, we are not so literal as our ancestors. Uh, best but way, really, when you no go into. Uh, are you ready to join us? I when am. you're going after him, uh, Rodrigo, at the final while, area is. Like so many things. Just run and gun through the guards until you get inside the building. And then you gotta be a you little sneaky, sneaky. Come. You we just gotta hit to the do. right hiding spots. But you can move through pretty quick. Uh, and then you just gotta, you know, you can sit and listen to him for as long as you want to, or you just take him out. It's up to you. And there we go. Easy money! Seven grand. Alright, so this will, we should go back to the villa, I think. Uh, Venetian Cape. That's the other cape I couldn't remember yesterday. Remember? I was trying to uh, figure out what the other cape was. It's the Venetian Cape. That's the blue one. The uh, Auditory 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 <laughs> Cape is the red and black. Are you okay? Do you want to stop? No. I need to go back. Right now. And then... Uh, Straight, it's the red one with the the uh, Medici Hold on. symbol. There's the Medici cape, around. and then you got your plain cape. Yep, those are the capes. And this one's corrupted too. Let me check another. <coughs> this one seems okay. I'm gonna All run right. some diagnostics, but at least now you can continue. There you go. Or we could take a break. If and then to. once we do, no, I would advise against Once that. you do that, then you get. Abstergo is none too pleased about losing you and Lucy, Cut and it's back only a matter to of time modern before they want to go here. And we better finish with this get before then. Attacked by Vidic and his goons. All right, but what so about the missing years? Anything important happened that we should know about? 
All right, let's take a look, shall we? According to this, it's a rather tumultuous time for Florence. There you go. Following Lorenzo's death, the Medici are deposed, and a Dominican priest named Savonarola is given control of the city. Yeah. And he promptly turns it into the most miserable place on earth. According to this, it's when the bonfire of the vanities took place. Well, there you go. Hey, I like that movie. <laughs> oh, did you like that movie? Oh, that's interesting. What other movies do you like? Rebecca, the grown-ups are talking. <laughs> Let's see what else we have here. Oh, yes, Some the girl in Some trouble in Forley. A rather amusing anecdote about Katerina Swartzer and, well, her reproductive organs. I'll tell you later. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh. Oh, dear. Here we go. Sean? Of course. For the historical guy gone? not realizing who Rodrigo you Borgia is. want to share with is. the rest of us? Uh, and just having Rodrigo that reaction, Borgia I mean, is come on. Pope in 1492, You're supposed to know which these means things, Ezio's John. greatest enemy is now also the most powerful man in Italy. Yeah, and what a pope he was. I always wanted to visit the Vatican. Well, your luck's in, Desmond. Okay. Happy days. Get to go to the exactly Vatican. Off to the Vatican. There you go. All right, we've got to do the Codex Wall. <clears throat> Talk to Mario. Ezio! There we go. It is time, Uncle. Let us finish what you and my father started all those years ago. Wonderful. Indeed. Perhaps now we can finally make sense of this prophecy and put a stop to whatever it is the Spaniard is plotting. We should start by locating the vault. The Codex pages will lead us to it. Let's take a look. Okie dokie. That's what it, they mark. Probably all the different vaults around the world. Interact. Hit the eagle vision and we're good to go. Because the wall is ready to go. I'm just double checking, making sure nothing got twisted. Or skew. But no, that looks alright, yeah. There we go. Oh. There we go. Now let's try this. It, it is a map of the entire world. But there are lands shown here that do not exist. Apparently they do exist. Yes. I imagine they've yet to be discovered. Or rediscovered. How is this possible? Perhaps the vault will hold the answer. <sighs> do you see what Okay, it is so then? now we gotta go to the Vatican, go into the vault. Confront vault. Rodrigo all at the same it looks time. Looks like the vault is in Roma. Then the Spaniard. Yep. This is why he became Pope. There now you I go. understand. It's not the vault alone he's gained access to, but the staff as well. Yep. What staff? The papal the staff. The Codex always spoke of two keys, two pieces of Eden needed to open the vault. Yes. There you One go. One is the apple, and the other is the staff. The papal the staff. The papal staff is the second there piece you of go. Eden. For oh, years, oh, oh. no, decades, we've sought these answers. Wonderful, and now, wonderful, at last, we have wonderful. Them. But so too could the Spaniard. And Revelations. If he, does, if he finds a way into the vault, factoids, eh? its contents will you be You really gotta apple. love how people, uh, the, the, the writers and creators the of these games, the rest of you? have we'll intertwined actual historical events with this story. It's really good. And I think that's part of what Just always made, that's what part, eh. That's part of what made the Ezio saga so damn good, in my opinion. Uh, is is the interweaving of fact and fiction, you know. Might as well grab this before we go. You know, it just... <clears throat> the combination of it. I, I really just, you know, I, I find it very interesting, and Roma it's just, it makes it Let fun. Let me know when you are ready to depart. I'm ready to go. Let's go, baby. Let's go to Rome. Uh, just makes it that much more uh, attractive, uh, you know, and that that's something I think that we're missing still with the modern ones. They touch on it a little bit just with historical figures that the characters come into contact with. 
but you know you just don't have that uh, where where you're kind of just sitting in the shadows of the major historical events you, you, you do you get what I'm saying on that you know like with with this particular game you know Ezio sits just in the shadows of the Borgia rise to the papacy you know so it's, it's you know it's just very uh, interesting I guess maybe that's interesting here all right where are we going from here that's where we're going it's a little bit different from when uh, we'll be here in the next game but hey make do with it right There we go. All right. <clears throat> but, you know, even, you know, like with Valhalla, I mean, okay, so you have interaction uh, with the kings and, and other people of that period. But uh, you don't have the story. I don't know. The story just isn't intertwined the same. It to me at least, it's not intertwined the same as these are. You know, between this and Brotherhood. Okay, so there's that. They're gonna stop there for a second, but they're also gonna go this way. There we go. Quick and easy. Okay, so there's that. Eventually we're going to become notorious. Oh well, it happens. You can't really avoid it because you're going to get into it with the guards no matter what. So, you might as well just welcome it. And rock it out, you know. Just go full on out. There. Okay, so we got him out of the way. We got to go up. There's one up there too, by the way. That we got to deal with. So you go this way. Throw him down. Open the gate. That helps us get to the next area. And like I said, just kind of... If you can get the I'm so you die. Somebody's throwing stuff at me and I don't like it. There must be an archer that out of my sight. Yeah. You little. You are not going anywhere. Dick. Come on. There we go. All right. And we've got to. Climb this. This is what we climb. We gotta go to the top here. There's that. And then Assassino! Assassino! you're busted. Your their alarm is raised, so jump on the horse. <laughs> and away you go. Ah, oh that's a shame. Yeah. Just 
fight him. Take him out as quick as you can. Or you can get on the horse and ride away, but they're still going to chase you down. So eventually you're going to have to fight them. Uh, it's just how many do you want to fight at once is the question. There we go. We got pass him. Okay. If you're quick enough about it. Well, that was pretty rude on that gentleman's part. Somehow they got across, you know, so, all right. There we go. Too bad this wasn't Brotherhood because we could chain our attacks, but it's very difficult to chain your attack in this game, I find. I can do it every once in a blue moon, but I'm not terribly good at it. Maybe I'm just not hitting the right button at the right time is probably it. I don't know. There we go. Okay. Take some more out. You won't get away this time. Do this. There's he. There's he. Ah, oh, come on. Why you gotta kick me in the nuts? Come on, that's not nice. That's dirty pool, son. There, return the favor. Come on. All right, that's a rose and bow. There we go. All right, I'm gonna heal real quick. Whoop. I'm gonna heal real quick. <clears throat> okay, here we go. We gotta go up. Up we go. Super jumps. Super jumps all around, all around. Really not terribly concerned about these guys. <coughs> Alright. Maybe we can pick up an extra medicine, like right there. Okay. Medicine right there. See, no matter what you do, they're coming at you. Oh, come on. Respond to what you're doing, my friend. There, he's done. There, he's done. Okay, he's done. Medicine, please. Okay, oh, we got smoke bomb. I didn't realize I was low on smoke bombs. I'm not anymore. Okay, we're down two medicine. We're down one medicine. Okay, this, you know, if you don't want to stop and loot, that's fine. You don't have to. I like to keep the medicines as full as I can. So that's why I loot during this section. Just because, you know, you never know. All right, go over here. One lousy guard right there. He's done. As you can see, our notoriety is through the roof. We don't need anything else, so I'm not going to loot him. Take him out real quick. 
Now if you do this quick enough, you can go from one haystack to the next. Take him out there. And then here they come back. What about, wait a minute. Double A there. See, it's just you can get it kind of fluid to an extent. That's about as fluid as it's going to get. Okay, there's that. Now, if you run and gun these guys really quick, get a double on them. Uh, there is one. See, he's right down there. So watch that guy over there. Once he turns away, then you, you can pretty much nail that guy from anywhere. Okay, he's going to come back this way. Back his turn. Don't run at him because he'll hear you. You can just sneak up behind him. Right there, he's done. Now, you've got four down there. And you've got two right there. So watch these guys, the four. There's the patrol. When they turn their back... They're going to come up this way, but when they turn their back to go that way, right there. Now. Then that'll give you time. There you go, because you're going to have a whole slew of these guys coming out. What am I doing? What am I doing? Take him from behind. What am I doing? We together. Hold him. Take the big man out first. Just like that night in Alba. Cabrito, get back. Take the big man and the long weapon out. That's the best way you see, because these guys... There. He's toast. Just stay on the big man, and then you just watch the guys behind you if you get caught in this situation. There. Well, that, that actually went quite smooth, in my opinion. I don't know what you're thinking, but I think that went quite well. Uh, where are we at for medicines? All right, we'll f we're full on medicines. I don't need to screw around with these guys any more than I have to. So here we go over to this door, climb this scaffolding, and up and over this railing. See the little glowing thing there? That's going to open the door. Pretty self-explanatory. And then you just jump down. And then now we're inside. Now in here, you got two guards down there. One's going to be patrolling. So if you're quick enough, you can kind of get over to these guys here. Oh, this is there. No, these guys stay. These guys are stationary. They don't move. Okay, take him out. Nobody's causing a ruckus. Then you come over here. He's none the wiser. All right, it's the it's the it's the next section where you got uh, a roaming guard. That's right. That was the easy section. So we're gonna go right here. There's that guard. He's moving. You time it just right. You can get around him. So you go here. Now you're gonna want to wait for him to come back around. Okay. All right, then you're going to want to kind of pep your step over to here. Whoops. All right. Screwed the pooch on that one. Fortunately, we had hit the... Uh, so I rushed it. We had hit the um, checkpoint. That's what I was thinking of. Checkpoint. So we're going to go right into that again. So again, we can just kind of, we're going to speed walk, well, run and speed walk a little bit, because these guys don't move. Go take this guy out. Now, oh, now I remember what I did when I did this, yes. Okay, so 
Take these guys out. Pretty simple, right? Okay, now, before I throw the switch, switch to poison. All right, you're going to switch to poison. Now, you're going to want to... Oops, I didn't want to take his money. Okay, so he's... Blend in with these guys. Get that guard off your back. Get back into these guys here. So that guard's over there being poisoned. This guard's over here. He's going to be weird and poisoned. Kind of blend back in until they break. Okay, those guards are going to go, what the heck's going on? He's going to start flailing around. See? These guys might get spooked, they might not. Okay, these guys got spooked. Get away. And then you can just come over here. Kind of keep an eye on those guards to see what happens. The monks are going to run around. If we're lucky, they'll position the monks. Okay. All right, they're going to go check it out. Now I can go. Eyes open. Anyone? There. Just like that. See how we did that? Wait till they go inspect, and then you can, <clears throat> excuse me, you can double assassinate them. Now this, it's just a matter of free running. Guards are gone. You're going to go, <clears throat> excuse me again. Uh, Jump here. You're going to go to the right side of this. Okay. Now, Rodrigo's right there in the papal position. And he's going to go on and on and on if you don't shut him up. So you might as well just shut him up. Take him out. That is that. Those guys are going to get scared. They're going to think you killed him. And then he's going to come back to life because you didn't really kill him. Because he's got the papal staff. But I'm not. Because it's a piece of Eden. Lost too much. Requiescat in pace, you bastard. Here we go. I don't think so. Here, see, there you go. He's got a piece of Eden. You got a piece of Eden. No! no! Of course, he's going to scare the crap out of all the monks. Sucks their energy, whatever. But because you got the apple, you're immune to it. How is it you resist? He doesn't get it because I he's see. not that bright until kind of now. You to bring me the apple. Now give it here. Come and take it, Rodrigo. Come on, Popey. Oh, is the fight just like your father? Well, rejoice, my child, <laughs> for you will see him again soon. Rodrigo Borgia, you the Pope of Dope. me, as you wish. Here we go. We've seen this before. Fascinating. All right. An impressive power, this. But if you think it's going to there save you, you, another thing coming. All right. So let's get it on. We're gonna fight him a little while. Knock him down a few health. A clever trick, but useless. Now, if you want to get quick about it, you probably could throw some smoke bombs. Take him out that way. But you only have three smoke bombs, me. so... You gotta kind of... Hammer home on him. Just keep on him. He'll break. The, yeah, well. You are right to fear me. See, I, I don't know why they just sit there and let him do that, but. Because I'm not. I am hitting buttons to dodge and everything, but it's not. I'll cut you down. Oh, there we go. Finally, I. Let's get the dodge. 
But he's not attacking. I'm, I'm trying to attack and he's not attacking. So, alright, fine, Rodrigo. Okay. How long do you think you can keep this up? Keep it, I'm I'm keeping it up as long as I can. How long can you keep it up, old man? I'm younger. What is he? Do? Look at this. All right, now I forgot that I had this. A clever trick. Useless. Come on, nothing's working with this idiot. You are right to fear me. I've never had this much trouble with him. I never have. I don't understand it. I'll cut you down, assassin! There we go. Finally, it took forever, didn't it? Jeez, oh, Pete, no, I've never had that much trouble with him before. It's okay. finished, Rodrigo. Lay down your arms, and I will make sure they end no, come he's gonna, swiftly. He's gonna sucker Please. punch you, Etz. And would you give up so He's gonna sucker punch you. Oh, there you go. Get knocked Why back. Don't find out? Let me take the apple. Oh, that's right, the disappearing act. Jeez, oh, Pete. Ugh. At last. There's the apple. And now, to deal with you. You think so? See what you got, old man. Armor absorbed it mostly. Merely a flesh wound. Typical though. Typical, typical. Okay, so he's down there. The priests are coming around. The monks are coming around. <clears throat> They're all going to think, hey, you're... All right, so go to Eagle Vision. See that? You got a couple of buttons here to push. There you go. Interact. Okay, then you go get the other one. Groovy, groovy, groovy. Might as well heal while I'm at it. Got another fight to go with Rodrigo. Hopefully this one goes a little bit what quicker and better place? than the previous. He's down here trying to figure out why he can't do anything. Open, damn you! He can't open, open it because he's not the guy to open it. It's over, Rodrigo. There no more go. tricks. No more ancient artifacts. No more weapons. Let us see what you are made Straight up man. fight. All right then. If that's how you want to play it. Should be able to just box him right down. Come on. What do you even want with the vault, Rodrigo? Don't you know what lies within? Just stick and move. Or do you mean to tell Counter. me the great and powerful assassins didn't figure it out? Figure what out? God. Go it's on the attack. God dwells within me. You Watching for the counter and then counter his counter. A more logical location than a kingdom in a cloud, don't you think? Surrounded by singing angels and cherubim. Just like that. Makes for a lovely image. But the truth is far go. more interesting. Stand on him, stand on him, stand on him. Whoop. Let him believe. in on that one, didn't I? What do you think he'll do when you open that door? I don't care. 
It's not approval I'm after. Well, he's pretty, Just power. pretty spry for an old guy, isn't he? You think you'll give it up? Whatever so lies we got a heck of a lot more health than he did, so I'm not worried about it. They were made I would have liked it if he wouldn't have laid a hand on me, but God it happens. God is meant to be all-knowing, all-powerful. You think a couple of ancient relics can harm him? You know nothing, boy. You take your image of nice the two. from an ancient book. A book, mind you, written by men. You are the Pope, and yet you Come dismiss on. the central text of your faith? <laughs> are you so naive? I became Paul because it gave Basically, me Basically, you just gotta listen to me power. power. Do you think I believe a single goddamn word of that ridiculous book? It's all lies and superstition. Just like every other religious tract written over the past See, 10 years. Because we, we've years. beat him to a pulp by now. So you basically just gotta last through... Last through his little speech. I'm pressing X. I'm pressing X. There you go, alright. Maybe that's just to choke him out. I don't know. It's what it is. You can't. You can't. Oh, it's I can. my destiny. No, it's not your destiny. My nah, nah. You're mistaken. I am the You're prophet. mistaken. No prophet. You never were. There you go. Get it over with, then. No. Killing you won't bring my family back. See? I'm Matured, done. aged. He'd probably be in his early 30s at this point, late 20s maybe at this point of, the, of his life. Possibly. Okay. So here we go. Activates it. Should I leave the secrets for you to discover, or should we play through it? Mm. All right, yeah, I'll play through it. I'll let you see it. We'll go Greetings, there. Prophet. It is good you have come. Let us see it, to give thanks. Okay, here we go. Minerva. All right. We must speak. Who are you? Many names. When I died, it was Minerva. Before that, Merva and Mera. And on and on. There you go. The others, too. Juno, who was before called Uni. Jupiter, who was before called Tinia. There you go. You are... gods. <laughs> no, not gods. We simply came... before. Blah blah blah, Even blah blah blah. The world, your kind struggled to blah, 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 our existence. blah blah blah. We were more... advanced in time. Your minds were not yet ready. They kind of expanded Still, from the trio of the now. three. Than they no in, in modern you games. You may not comprehend us, but you will comprehend our warning. Okay. You must. None of what you are saying makes sense. Our words are not go. meant for you. What are you talking about? They're meant for Desmond. There's no one else here. Enough. I do not wish to speak with you, but through you. You are the prophet. You've played your part. Okay. You anchor him, but please be silent that we may commune. Come on then. Listen. Hurry up and talk. Yes. When we were still flesh and our home still whole, your kind betrayed. Oh, he's got the Venetian cape on. We I didn't even realize that. You. We who gave you life. We were strong, but you were many, there, there and you both of us craved the war. So busy were we with earthly concerns, we failed to notice the heavens. 
And by the time we did, there you go. the world burned until naught remained but ash. Well, this is, you know, this is what it is, so uh, I'm going to wrap this video up, and this is basically the end of AC2, obviously, you know, the only thing left to do on this is you go back out of the Animus, and there's a little confrontation between you and Vidic and his goons, and that's it. Uh, but, yeah. So if you, if you enjoyed what you're watching, hey, follow me on Twitch. Uh, if you're watching this on Twitch, dying. please click the follow the button. Will work you know, us. I really appreciate it. Uh, join me on the live streams when I, what you know, I usually do Assassin's Creed whenever I can. Uh, I do schedule a Horizon playthroughs. So look at the schedule, and, you know, if you like Horizon. Uh, if you're watching this on YouTube, I would appreciate it. If you like the video, then just click the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you would do so, please. Click notifications so if you want to know when the next videos are available on YouTube, you'll know. You'll be the first to know. Okay? And, you know, so anybody, uh, yeah. That's, that's pretty much it. So until, you know... Stand next time I would and next time I guess we're gonna be doing uh AC Brotherhood for the Assassin's Creed. Right? Yeah, we're gonna start Brotherhood next up for the AC uh streams. So what was I doing? Oh yeah, I lost my train of thought. So yeah, we're gonna start Brotherhood uh probably I don't know if I'll do it later today or if I'll do it tomorrow. I don't know. Uh, but we are starting Brotherhood soon. That will be coming soon. So again, follow me on Twitch. Uh, like, share, subscribe. Click notifications on YouTube. And as always, treat all those you come in contact with with kindness, dignity, and respect. So until next time, ta-ta.